Welcome to Mabin Antique Auction Gallery. I'm John Lambert. We have a very special event happening here on May 29th, 2021, beginning at 10 a.m. It's a catalog sale comprising of about 500 lots, all discovered here in North Carolina, with four featured families that have inherited these goods. One collection out of Fayetteville is the Renaissance Art Collection. Their father collected art in the 1970s, up to about 1985. Done a lot of his purchasing at Sotheby's and Christie's and Sloan's. We've got a lot of important European art from Italy, England, and America. We started right here with the Nuremberg, Germany, 17th century original maritime treasure chest. It has seven tumblers, if you look on the inside plate, and the original key. There's a maker in Nuremberg, Germany, and we strongly attribute it to him. If you look closely at the inner plates here, you've got a twin set of mermaids looking at each other. The lock is also in, on the interior, a little money box, so it's a safe inside of a safe. It's been well kept and preserved and in working condition. It's a real interesting, true pirate's chest. We found these tucked away under a old desk. They have been confirmed South American, more than likely Costa Rica. These are probably around a thousand years old or older. We have consulted with experts and they have confirmed the authenticity of these. We hope you uh, pay close attention to these and view the detailed photographs that we have online. Another very important discovery here at Mabin Auction. We are very excited about the Asian art and antiques that we have in this event. Here is a monumental carved jade and soapstone Chinese sculpture. The emperor is placed in the top of the mountain. As it goes through, you have the monkey god and his soldiers recent discovery of four important Southern Alamance County pottery, redware, slip decorated dirt dishes. We have full detailed provenance and history where these dishes have been for the last 150 years. They descended through the Coble Henshaw family of Southern Alamance County. The first example has the classic swiggle Southern Alamance County design, more than likely made by Solomon Lloyd. And then you have two splatter plates here and then one plane. All these descended through the consigner's family. During the Fayetteville discovery, we found this old car. It is a Izetta 300 that was originally owned by the collector of the Renaissance paintings. It has the original license tag where he parked it in 1963 with the Raleigh City tag. I think that's neat. I'm a proud North Carolinian and the North Carolina tag is still present. It looks a totally original. It's 75 miles a gallon has the original VIN number. So we encourage all car enthusiasts, especially mid-century modern designers here, to take a look at this rare IZETA 300. During our inventory and clean out of the Fayetteville warehouse, we located these Russian icons in file cabinets, separated by paper and cardboard, neatly stacked and tucked away. If you look closely at this one here, it has Russian silver hallmarks around the perimeter of the frame and the detail of the gold gilting on some of these are incredible. One of the more exciting pieces that were discovered in the Fayetteville Art Collection Warehouse Discovery is this portrait of this gentleman. We have identified him as Sir Ian Standish Monteith Hamilton. Friends with John Singer Sargent. John Singer Sargent painted him two other times. Look closely at the brush strokes, look at the colors. He's in full uniform holding his sword and we encourage all John Singer Sargent experts to view this very carefully closely could be a very important new discovery. Here we have Lot 1, the Adoration of the Magi, a beautiful scene depicting the nativity from the Bible. Lot 2 in this event is the masterfully painted Marriage at Cana, where Jesus turned water into wine by Italian artist Gabrielle Cagliari. Also included in this event from the estates that we're representing here in North Carolina are a major collection of fine estate jewelry, including Petit Philippe wristwatch, Rolex watches, fine estate diamonds, and precious stones and gemstones. We also have a number of North Carolina early 19th century examples, such as handmade furniture, four quilts here, one that descended through the Branding estate that owned Pilot Mountain. We encourage all 
bidders and all collectors and private institutions and museums to visit our website at mevinauction.com or you may go straight to Invaluable and see the online catalog information. We also take appointments for private viewing, also accepting phone bids and absentee bids, as well as internet bids, and our gallery will be able to handle around 50 people. We will be taking temperature checks and social distancing and having face covering, May 29th at 10 a.m. A lot of our clients will also monitor our sale in our parking facility and come in when their lot is coming up and do live bidding. So we invite you to do that and feel safe here at Mavid Auction.